guys, welcome back to Kate's Town, and we are talking about how to be a leader. Mm. And our memory verse is 1 Samuel 16, 7, right? God does not see as man sees. God looks at, mm, man looks at the outward appearance, mm -hmm. but God looks at the heart, right? Right. So when we think about leadership or being a leader, I know a lot of people may disqualify themselves because they're thinking, oh, I'm too short, or I'm too young, or I'm only in the third grade, or you know, a lot of things mm -hmm. that we may feel like may hinder us from actually being what God just naturally expects us to be, right. um, honestly. And a perfect example would be David, right? Mm -hmm. um, David, you know, was, his family was met by Sammy the prophet. Mm -hmm. Samuel is looking for a king. David had several siblings. Oh, wow. You know, Samuel is looking everyone over, and God is, you know, kind of telling him, like, there's one left. You know, Samuel inquires, and the dad, David's dad, is like, well, yeah, we have one, one more left. One but it's like more. this little guy, you know, out yeah. in the field, Who's right? taking care of the sheep. Yeah, like no it, wasn't even, <laughs> it wasn't even in the house, didn't you know? Care. Right. <laughs> and then, um, he, but as we all know, those of us that read our Bible, David was chosen to be king, yeah. and he was a great king, the Bible um, tells us. Now, what does it take to be a leader? Are you kind? Mm -hmm. Are you treating others with respect? Super Are important. Are you loving and respectful mm -hmm. and obeying you, your parents? Are you listening to those around you? Are you listening you to listening? people's concerns? Right. Yeah. Because are you courageous? Right. Because that's initially why David was chosen. David was chosen because he had a courageous heart. In exactly. fact, he was more courageous than all of his other brothers. It's true. So, what do you think? Hmm, what do you think being a leader means? Hmm. Well, with leadership, there's also that element of being influential um, towards people and in, in people's lives. We think a lot about maybe celebrities that have influence on people and mm -hmm. how you have a lot of people on social media who push so hard to have, you know, that stardom to have that influence, but is your influence a good thing or a bad thing? The people out there that you watch, are they being good leaders? Are they people that you should be looking up to to have as a leader? So that is something that comes to mind for me is that level of influence, which can be either good or bad. Absolutely. Um, I looked the word up this morning, and it says that a leader can be anything from a commander, which we, that's pretty obvious, right? A person mm -hmm. that commands, a guide. I can't help but think of like the Holy Spirit, right? The Holy Spirit is great. And then it says conductor. Now, a conductor is a body that allows for electricity, but if you're a believer, power to flow through you, mm -hmm. right? And that's pretty much what it's about. You know, being a leader, God is trusting you with that power, mm -hmm. and He's expecting for us to lead others in the right direction. Exactly. But like you said, the opposite of leading up is leading down, down. Right? right? And I mean, we can sit here and give you examples, but there are so many mm -hmm. voices and so many people out that are leading down, right? They're telling yeah. people the wrong things or they're mm -hmm. um, inciting fear or mm -hmm. not being encouraging and things like that. Right. But it's important to remember that God is not looking at the outward appearance. Anyone could be a leader regardless of age, size, height, qualifications. You can be a leader, and that's right. what we're going to be talking about this week. And we have some an awesome skits in, in plan, so yeah. can we for you guys to see it. And also, guys, don't forget that Jesus is the ultimate leader. Yes, so no is. matter who you love looking up to, don't forget that Jesus should be in that number one spot as far as leadership is concerned. Absolutely. Oh.